practice fighting him. Very well, go and open the chest in the first section of the training area. Well, thank you. Well, the world beyond Hollow Grange is a dangerous place. Always be ready for the attack by hitting a, a, having a weapon in your hand or some spares on your belt. Also remember that some weapons are better against some creatures than others. Skirlings, for example, test like take less damage from blood weapons than sharp ones. But how do I know which weapons to use? Trial and error, my lad. Part of the fun of adventuring always try to keep different weapons and magic handy on the belt. When you first face a creature in combat, you are automatically armed with whatever is currently in your hand. Note, you cannot access the backpack during combat. Shamshir, ornate axe, short sword, orin katar. Yeah. What the hell? Does this have to take turns? Ornate axe. Do it. So, look, he's just attacking me. I have to wait for the turn to end, I guess? I don't know. Strange blocking thing. Hmm. I have to wait for that little bar to empty and just attack. Huh. That's different. I thought it'd be like a hack and slash. Huh. Okay, that's first enemy down. Well done, Jarek. If you have been fighting a real monster, you would have gained proficiency points. Oh, that's what PP is, and sometimes treasure. Proficiency points? What are those? Yes, you can use these to improve your skills with weapons or spells. You can always improve existing skills, but you need to pay for training in ones you do not have. Where can I get training? For that, you must travel to the Saurgen city of. Yeah, that place again. Teach me how to use spells. I guess not. Well, what's over here? Some magic works better against creatures than other. Alright. All of sound, tears, stone orb, spike potion. Oh. Oh. Attack it. Orb of Tears. Stone Orb. What was that? Sonic Blast. Alright. Sonic Blast! I just punch it. Crap, stupid thing. Orb of Tears. I only did two. Alright, let's do s well, for sounds. No, uh, it's even more. Get another ten points. I don't have the magic. Alright, let's do the spike potion. Alright, that's the final step. Stone orb. Seems to turn to stone. Dead yet? Damn. I only did two, so more of a sound is ten, it seems. Okay. More potion there. Wait for that to replenish, I guess. Huh? Punch it. Die! Oh, 
that's the reason I'm going back up. To not replenish. Yeah, that spike potion seems to replenish the magic. It's almost dead, just keep punching it, I guess. Taking longer than it should. Oh crap. Yeah, well. A little sperm with arms and legs and a beak. Hey, there's dead, fine. Finally. You're gonna walk all the way Yeah, you're gonna walk all the way back, huh? Well done, Jarek. Yeah, that's enough from you. What's in this one? Oh, it's gonna walk all the way come on. I guess that's other items, huh? Final test in your training, I want you to battle two monsters using both orbs and weapons with the other items in your inventory. Are you ready? Yeah. You go to the third chest over there and equip yourself and I will conjure to practice skirlings. Alright. Now Jake, take the various items and orbs in the chest, I will conjure two training skirlings. Shamsar, Orn Katar, Ornate Axe. Okay. Two of them going at once. Orb. What's this? Uh, that's way better. Yeah, that's a long sword. It takes a long time for the finish though. Yeah, stone orb. I do not have enough. Alright, well let's just... Just hit him. I'm gonna die soon. Ah, it just takes so long though. Kind of annoying. He's dead. You have to wait for the bar to to uh, empty so you can attack again. <laughs> and they just keep attacking you. Taking a break? I don't know. I guess not. And you horny axe. Oh, that takes a long time too. Hmm. What have we got here? Short sword. All right. Faster. Well, it's almost dead. Pretty slow battle system. Alright, he's dead. I did it! Yeah! Eat it! Alright, we're done. Old Jarek Yard. As you're leaving for the day, I must take any training items you borrowed. Of course, Dayless. Crap. Heal my wounds, alright. So you're gonna take all the stuff back, great. Drinking horn, alright, it's two. Are all the drinking horns in the town? Skirtlings, I wonder how Lord Court has let them wander so close to the main highway. Some, something must be amiss in Pilgrim's Hatch. It would be dangerous to hollow grave if they wander this way. Perhaps I should deal with them myself. I guess I have to load that area in there, but see if we can find any more horns. Oh, being collected, okay. Since I'm rock. I'm guessing the other horns are in the town. 
I could run faster. There's another one. Yep. It's three. Two more. So this is the area he ran to in the cutscene. Maybe there's something up here. Of course there isn't. Why would there be? Slowly run over here. Strange looking sheep. I can't tell if that's another horn. Maybe just another rock. If we get over there, we'll be able to tell. Bane. This looks promising down here. Yep, there's another horn. That's four. guy it is. Guy from the house maybe. And this guy, here we go. You brought back all five of the horns! You are truly a worthy man, Jarek. Except this 30 in gold to show my appreciation. And there's a fire truck. Alright. Well, let's use this time to go save now. Okay, now what? Uh, any weapons yet? No. Some more potions? Alright. Now that you have been to the keep, you should be prepared for your journey. Make your way where. May the weird keep you upon the true path. I don't have any weapons! I can't use that hammer I found, right? Oh, I can. Alright, well, let's use the... Hmm. Chow pin tool. Uh, let's just use the sword. Proficiency points. Alright. What would I do for that? Skill level zero. Oh. What do you mean I got enough proficiency points? Hmm. Well, I just go then. Let's go to the bridge, perhaps. See what's going on in that bridge up here. Okay, it's only the ones where the rock you can get. This person. To talk to that person. 